Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing a book haul and I know it's been like a few weeks since I've made a video That is just because I went to camp, I got sick after camp so you know I couldn't really film then So now I'm back and I've got a bunch of books from the library and Barnes & Noble here to show you I'm just gonna get right into the book haul The first two books are the books that I bought and the first one is Opposition by Jennifer L. Armantrout And it's the last book in the Lux series that I've been reading since like, um... I think it was last month, so I am about more than halfway through because the whole last part is the um, novella for Obsidian, so yeah, that I'm like almost done actually, and that's making me really, really depressed because I just love the series so much and I really don't want it to end, and the cover is a lot better than the other covers, but it's still, you know not the prettiest thing in the world. Adoring it so far. It is amazing. So much better than like the second and third book, which weren't that great, but this one's just really amazing and I'm loving it. The next book I bought is Lola and the Boy Next Door by Stephanie Perkins and I read Anne and the French Kiss. I have it over on my shelf and I adored it, so I decided to buy Lola and I'm planning on reading this sometime this month. Not sure when yet. I'm not sure when I'm going to read it because I'm not sure if I'm going to be in the mood for a contemporary after I read Opposition, but once I'm in the mood for this, I will definitely read it. Or if I get in like a reading slump, I always read contemporary because they usually get me out. So I just, I'm really excited to read this because Anne and the French Kiss was just perfect. There's no bad thing I can say about it. So I'm very excited for Lola. Next, I found more Harry Potter books at my library. I couldn't find them literally anywhere besides, you know, at Barnes & Noble, but I really didn't want to pay $25 for a book. Yeah, I decided to try and find them at the library, and I couldn't find them literally anywhere. I could only find the first book, so I read the first book. I just adored it, and I found the second and third book at the library, and I'm so excited to read these. It's Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets and Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. And I just adore Harry Potter movies, so I finally decided to read the books, finally got the hands on them, and I'm very excited to read them. The next book I got is a very big one, and it is The Diviners by Libba Bray. This is a 1920s based paranormal book, I think. I'm not completely sure what it's about, I just heard that people love it, so decided to get it. I'm pretty excited to read it. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to be in the mood for a super long book because this is like 500 pages long or something. The next book that I got from the library is The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hodkin. And I've tried to read this before. I think I got it like last month. I read the prologue and I was like really creeped out. But I really like, I've been hearing more things about the series and about the love interest in it, Noah Shaw, and I heard he's like complete perfection. So I just said perfection. Hmm. So I decided to pick it up again, try it out. If I'm not like completely creeped out by it, I might keep going. But it seems like a really, really cool book, but mm, I have mixed feelings on it. So I'm probably gonna try to read this sometime this month. The next book that I got at the library is A Million Sons by Beth Brevis, and this is the second book in the Across the Universe series, or trilogy, I think. And I read Across the Universe, the first, like, 100 pages of it were really boring, so I gave it, like, 3.5 or 4 stars, but I really enjoyed it, the end was really cool, so I've decided to keep going with the series and see where the characters end up. Hoping this will be equally as cool. The actual last book in this haul is Champion by Marie Lu, and this is the third and final book in the Legend series, and I'm very excited to read this. I read like five pages of it before, but I really just wasn't feeling it, so I started um, Origin, I think, the fourth book in the Lux series, and I loved that. So um, I'm not sure when I'm going to read this, hopefully sometime this week maybe. But I really want to finish the series before I have to take this book back, and I'm really excited to finish it because the series has been really great so far, and I hope the ending does not disappoint. So those were all the books I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. And I'm going to start um, filming more like non-bookish type videos, I've, as I've said in my other video, my last video, where I said I was going to kind of like, rebrand my channel. So. Yeah, I'm going to start filming more of those videos, so I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.